We're here at Pat Nodes in Gatineau. I'm joined with Nick Pedno. How are you doing, Nick? I'm doing very well. Thank you for having me. Well, thank you. And uh, you are fighting this Friday for Heroes Combat League uh, at Sala San Marco. Exactly, yeah. I'm very excited. I prepared so hard and I'm ready to put on a good show. So Nick's prepared very hard for this fight. Originally, you were supposed to fight Zach Powell, but Zach got injured and you didn't know as to whether or not you were going to have an opponent, a replacement opponent. Is that right? Yeah, ex exactly. He got injured. I, I heard it happens in the sport, uh, unfortunately for him. Um, but uh, yeah, they, they ask a lot of, of guys, different school, not a lot of people accepted uh, to fight. but Because uh, they're afraid of you. <laughs> I don't know, but uh, it was a big opportunity. But uh, uh, Looney accepted the fight, so uh, I'm thankful for him. So uh, because of him, I, I, I got a chance to fight for the belt. Uh, but uh, unfortunately for him, I'm going there to win. So, When a fighter trains for, for a fight and then they hear that their opponent got injured and they don't know as to whether or not they're going to have an, a replacement opponent, what happened? How did you feel during that break? Uh, I was a little bit bummed out because it was uh, two weeks before the fight. So I was a little bit scared that I wasn't going to fight. But I, my coach told me, uh, you, you prepare, you fight going to train the uh, same thing as uh, you would if you were going to fight we will find someone so I never stopped training train super fo uh, hard focus and uh, we found a fight so I'm ready yeah. what do you know about your opponent Lonnie Harrington what do you know about him nah honestly not much uh, I don't really uh, focus on what my opponents are going to do I'm focused on what I'm going to do I know if I'm a hundred percent ready Wherever the fight goes, uh, I'll be ready. I know you've kind of answered that already, but what is your plan? Uh, there's Without giving it away, obviously. There, for real, no plan. I go there, I'm going to win. That's it. I'm, I'm not uh, thinking like, okay, second round, uh, we'll take him down. No, no. Uh, anything, whatever happens, I'm ready. That's it. So you're four and one, correct? Exactly, yeah. yeah. Uh, and you're fighting for the belt. Yeah. What happens afterwards? Uh, are, are you looking, is this the, the fight that will dis, uh, determine whether or not you cross over into the professional league? What, give us uh, the background on that. What, what happens? So when I win the belt, uh, I feel like I, I've beat everyone. I did, uh, I dominate pretty much everyone and I, I plan on going on the pro and uh, doing the same thing and winning a belt in the professional as well. Well, thank you very much for your time. We certainly look forward to, to seeing you fight. Originally, we were obviously looking forward to, see, to seeing two local Gatsino athletes, that's Zach Powell versus Nick Pedno, but it's great that Lonnie Harrington has stepped up to fight you, and we look forward to, to this fight. It's happening this Friday at Sala San Marco. Go to www.heroescombatleague.com. Make sure you show up. you got to be there. This is going to be the fight of... There's nothing else happening in Ottawa. You gotta show up. Any last words? Anything else you want to share? Anyone else you want to thank? Any? Any? Yeah, sure. I would like to uh, thank for sure my coaches that have been there uh, since the beginning. Uh, they put so much effort uh, on us. They're they're uh, more. Uh, how can I say that in English? <laughs> There's so much, they put so much time on us. I, I really appreciate for sure. All my training partners that are there that pushes me and makes get, get me bigger, uh, better, sorry. And uh, all my friends and family that are gonna be there. Uh, I'm gonna put on a good show for you guys, for sure. Well, thank you very much. We look forward to seeing this fight. Thank you, sir.